Got it right. Okay. Anyway, Swedish is alright. You know, he's a he's an okay melee player. Only okay, you yeah. know. He's like, cool. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> he, I, I actually don't... I actually haven't kept up with the melee rank. I think he's at least top 10 or top 20, if I recall correctly, the last melee on me. Okay. Uh, or the... I guess now it's the MPGR. Mm -hmm. So... Well, yeah, I mean the 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 M I O the M I O M is still out there. Oh yeah, it's, it's like partnered yeah. with. Yeah, they're they're still the, both the there, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, well let's see how he does in uh, ultimate because uh, melee players don't have. I'm a, actually exactly very a curious to see record. who he plays. Mm -hmm. I'm assuming it's not a character that's from melee, just because like when you when you switch between different Smash games, I feel like you have to play a character that is so much different than what you already play because when you start mixing the games you're gonna start thinking separate tech that isn't gonna work out yeah i mean that's exactly why mutu king didn't play sheik immediately mm -hmm. when smash 4 came out when he thought that sheik was the best character in the game i mean because Tof, it would Tof mess up melee um, sheik yeah Tof plays inkling mm -hmm. so like <laughs> kurt is definitely not in melee <laughs> yeah <laughs> All right, let's see. Uh, he plays Sheik in melee, so let's see what he goes for here. He's like combo heavy character. Whoa! Oh, is he Inkling? Wow. Okay. Inkling Ganondorf. I'm s okay. Well, this matchup is abysmal for Dorf. Uh, yeah. <laughs> like Inkling can just dance around. Look, okay, I believe in heavies. I play Ganondorf. Inkling, I have no faith in. <laughs> but I switch care. I'd rather go Ridley. Mm-hmm. Yeah, this is uh, this okay. can be potentially a rough situation, but let's see who knows uh, the mechanics more in this game. Well, so far, throw. Swedish Delight doing a good job so far. Yeah, getting a few grouts, back throw, sending Ganondorf right back off stage, comes a back air, another one. Ooh, he air dodges in. Oh, uh, no. okay. So, Swedish Delight takes out Swedish Delight's, Swedish Delight's first stock there. <laughs> it was doing so well. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Looking so good. We're like, oh, yeah, oh, let's go, oh, let's go melee player. He knows how to play ultimate. Oh, yeah. never mind. Yeah, he, he can't recover. <laughs> yeah. Oh, man. Okay, anyways, but here we go. So, Altino somehow with the lead. J Swedish Delight like, outplaying himself there. Anyways, here we go. And all of a sudden, that was like, kind of the momentum he needed. Now he's kind of... Yeah. Like going ham on okay, it. Okay, look, right when Ganondorf has a lead on you, it's so hard to get back. Yeah. Because then you gotta start approaching, and then you just get stuffed out, and you're pressing buttons, and then yeah. it's just not a good time. Backer, no, just running up, getting the forward throw, sends Ganondorf right back off stage. Backer, not gonna land. Ostino, oh my goodness, that forwarder so close to landing, but the down tilt, low profile, saving Swedish delight there. Okay, down there tilt, yeah, he, ah, he, he should be there. No, oh, he, he has, has a jump. jump. All right, all right, never mind, yeah. Okay. Man, that was this is like one of the biggest strategies I've ever seen in my life. You 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 have a big lead. Okay, there we go. Finally, he takes okay. out a stock there. Back air, another grab, leading into the upper. Has Ganondorf in the air, air dodge, and just covering all the options right there. Barely getting away from that down air attempt. Yeah, let's go. Swedish so delight all of a sudden, and he's got the big combo game that we were seeing on the first stock. Roller forward smash. Wow. I didn't think oh, he would have enough time. Up. Okay, Swedish Delight looking real good. That stock was a clean zero to death there. All right, he, he just evened it all the way up. He hit him with the Call of Duty special, but the Sparta kick coming out for Ostino. Evening it up. Last stock apiece now. Yeah. And now he's got a lot of ink on him. That's going to be a lot of damage. Already at 64%. And he's got the ledge control too. <gasps> oh, my goodness. Yeah, of course, the Doria. Very famous in I our had community. elite smash flashbacks. God damn. <laughs> oh, man. I've been hit by that so many times, so it's like disgusting. Anyways, here we go. Getting a little bit unsafe with those spot bombs. Could have definitely been punished there. I'm gonna try to go for another one, not gonna get it. Back on the ledge, forward air, gonna send Ostino right back off stage, down tilt. He has no jump, I'm surprised. Swedish Delight didn't try to go out there to get him. Try to continue on. Okay, there we go, I guess that's fair. Put him off stage one more time. Forces out the double jump, but can't get that back air to clip. That hitbox is very deceptive. It is so... It goes so far. <laughs> okay. Just point blank. All right. Sure. Hey, he, he, I'm he with it. Locked <laughs> and loaded. Yeah. Now, you playing Modern Warfare out here? All right. Back here. Yeah. Goodbye. Okay. There we go. You know, one thing that I will give, even if the melee players aren't, you know, that great at ultimate, for some of them, uh, one thing I give them credit always for is that they're really good at pushing advantage state. Like, they just know in melee how do you <laughs> keep your opponent trying to come back to neutral and Swedish Delight we saw obviously in that second stock he did such a great job of just making sure Asino couldn't get anything started on that second next stock he was able to bring that back despite that SZ at zero yeah. no I mean 
we already saw in that first talk, Swedish knew what he's doing, what he wants to do, how he wants to go ahead and press his advantage state, as you were saying. And, you know, he was able to go ahead and overcome that stock deficit, take that W. Now we're going into the second game, you know, with that experience, understanding, you know, I can't go that deep. I, I got to make sure I can come back. Right. And we're going to Yoshi's Island Brawl. Okay. I like and don't like this stage for Ganondorf. Yes, one forward tilt will go ahead and get you the stock very early. Or, or really any hit from Ganondorf is going to get the stock early, but you kind of run that risk against the Inkling as well. Yeah. Because Inkling a lot of times really struggle to get that stock at a higher percent. Mm -hmm. Additionally, the slants can kind of help Inkling. He's a, she's a bit of a shorter character. Mm -hmm. So at the, at the slant over there... Oh, that down tilt is going to be ridiculous. Work. Yeah. Because it literally goes off. Oh, yeah, he was a little bit too far there. But if yeah. he goes on the slant, that down tilt will cover it. Yep, just mm -hmm. like that. Yep. Oh, get him attack. Okay, I like it. Jumps right over the roller. I like that. It forces out the directional air dodge. No booyah this time. Woo! It's not that force smash you All wanted. Right, Swedish, you're going to have to pull up the uh, the percent sheet. I saw Tove do it a little earlier. <laughs> right, like, right before he started up his set, he looked at the... Um, the, the booyah the, percents? The, yeah, the booyah percents. And he's just like, all right, one something. All right, we in there. <laughs> Order, not Trying to find hit. the stock. There we go. Yeah, didn't be reverse the LB, so couldn't quite catch him off guard. So the one thing he actually does not have ink. So this might be a point to where Ostino can make some things happen. Never mind. He's done. He's done. Oh, he lost his a, jump. It's over. That it's was over. A quick zero to death again on the second stock, but mm -hmm. finally the Sparta kick will get Only something going. Hitting back here. That must, that must hurt. Yeah. Like you're you're just sitting there watching this. Like I can't air dodge. I'm dead anyway. If this happened. Yeah. <laughs> just it's tragic. All right, roller. All right, so we just kind of filling himself. Down air leading into that up air, right back to the ledge. Forward tilt not going to land. And because of the slant, he's able to actually jump over that, leading into the forward air. Okay, there we go. Gets the forward throw. Ah, uh, reads the directional air dodge. Doesn't catch the jump, though. He's we still got time. Grab. Yeah. Another back throw. Plenty of time to be able to get that. Oh, there goes the air dodge. Yep, did a little bit too early. That is going to be it. Swedish Delight with the 2-0. Yeah. Alrighty, let's see if we can get another person to make top eight in both melee and ultimate. Wizro being the first, so we'll see. Oh that man, crazy. my boy.